What is going on YouTube Lamont at large? Today we're in Houston, Texas. We're on the 14,000 block of Main Street. And I'm at this uh, little uh, shopping center right here. And ahead of you is a roadside memorial. And honestly, I'm not quite sure why it's here and who it's here for but let me explain the story so on march 28th of 2023 this just happened by the way i just happened to be in the area a food truck that has been operating in this very location right here for the last three years was here doing business this food truck was called elite eats and normally it would sit right about here and this food truck was owned by a woman. So on that day, Tuesday, March 28th, they're here doing business and it's around 1 p.m. and it's slow that day and they only had maybe three customers. And a guy comes into a truck, comes to this food truck in his own truck. He approaches the truck and asks them, hey, what kind of food do you have? So the woman, who happens to be a grandmother, she goes to grab a menu to show him what they had. This guy pulls out a gun and immediately when he did that, she slams the window to the trailer and the guy opens it again, points the gun at her and it jammed. Well, let me tell you, her gun didn't jam because she let this guy have it. She gave him a little bit of something that was not on the menu that day. She gave him a good size portion of lead. She shoots this guy multiple times. He runs about maybe 40 feet away from the, uh, the trailer. And I wanna guess he collapsed somewhere right there where those uh, parking stalls are right there. He was later identified as 23-year-old Ricky Jimenez. Ricky Jimenez lost his life for $40. If that guy would have gave me a telephone call, I could have gave him a bunch of different ways to make $40 that didn't involve him losing his life. So, I don't know exactly i'm assuming they're for the victim of this crime i don't know i don't know why anybody would want to leave flowers for a guy who tried to shoot and kill somebody and let me tell you the lord was definitely on that woman's side that day because that gun jammed and some some higher being up there was on that woman's uh, side that day. I don't see a name Yeah, I don't see a name I, I I mean could this be for the robber I have no idea I Originally wanted to come out here because I wanted to I don't you know listen. I'm curious. I was gonna come get something to eat And uh, the truck is not here so originally in the news story they had shut the truck down for a few days, but then they came back because the food truck is the main source of income for the family. And, uh, yeah, it's a shame. Uh, it's a total shame that this truck's not out here because of that. Well, maybe the, maybe it was very, very slow today, but I don't know. Maybe the family just wanted to take a break from the business until I don't know, things kind of die down, if you will. I, I don't know nothing about this guy that tried to rob uh, this truck. But I can tell you one thing, it's easy to see that this guy makes very poor choices in life. Absolutely incredible. I never understand why these people that want to commit these crimes out here on the streets in any city that where you or I currently are at, why they want to do these crimes. 
there's easier ways to make money even if it's the illegal way i mean i don't get it why would you want to take something from someone that has worked hard to build their business and you're just going to come because you need drugs or you need whatever whatever little fix you need i don't understand it anyways guys just wanted to show you that real quick and uh anybody out there thinking about committing any crimes especially in texas know this you can carry a weapon in texas without a license as long as you are legally allowed to own a firearm you can carry it in texas so let that be a lesson to any and all would-be robbers out there you know people ain't playing people are not playing that robber came by and uh he got he got he got uh he did a little bit of fafo if you know what i'm saying all right guys i'll catch up with you later on the next video have a good one peace out